first tour of Africa. As you know, we have been exemplary since, since March 1957. Now, shall we welcome on stage the CEO of GIPC, Mrs. Mawena Tawa. Ladies and gentlemen, a round of applause for Mrs. Mawena Tawa. Your Excellencies, very distinguished guests, Mesdames, Monsieur, Bienvenue. It gives me great pleasure to make these remarks on the 58th Independence Day celebrations of Ghana here in Paris. Under normal circumstances, I would have had the privilege of joining many other Ghanaians at Independence Square to watch the incredible parade that celebrates our great nation. It's my delight to have the opportunity to share this moment with you. Your presence here, and in such numbers, demonstrates the recognition that Ghana continues to enjoy globally in relation to Africa. The Ghana Investment Promotion Center has been working very closely with several partners and, of course, the embassy here in Paris for some time now in preparation for this event. I am personally delighted that this has become a reality because it truly sets a precedent for the way we create the Ghanaian experience abroad. I take this opportunity to thank Her Excellency for her foresight and her wisdom and her wonderful team for the tremendous work they have put into organizing this event and I think it does deserve a second round of applause. If you Permit me, Your Excellencies, for the purposes of our audience to speak briefly about Ghana. Ghana's credentials as a stable political democracy with a stable economy are well documented. Ghana's strategic global positioning means that you can connect to Europe in just six hours and the Americas in just nine hours. The Middle East is on average between seven and eight hours. With a skilled and trainable labor force, as well as good infrastructure, Ghana remains the destination of choice, known for ease of doing business, and we are number one for ease of doing business in West Africa when it comes to investing. In 2014, a total of 184, 184 new investment projects were recorded with a value of 3.57 billion US dollars. This year, with clear plans to address our major infrastructure requirements, particularly in the energy sector, in a medium to long term, we at GIPC have challenged ourselves to double these figures. Today we have the opportunity to challenge the French business community and Ghanaians in the diaspora to join us in that endeavor. French investors continue to invest in Ghana and I'm happy to say language has not been an issue. Over the past 10 years, 67 French companies have successfully invested in Ghana with a total investment of 107 million US dollars. The current French ambassador to Ghana, His Excellency Frédéric Clavier, has recently announced the intended visit to Ghana in April this year of a group of 50 French investors. In May 2013, we had the privilege to host a 35-member delegation from Medev who also visited Ghana to explore investment opportunities in the country. Your Excellencies, this demonstrates the interest that the French business community has in our country. And we have a very strong team here from Ghana, both private sector and public sector, who you're very welcome to engage with on a personal level to discuss your interest in investing. Today you can expect to see, taste, and generally experience Ghana. That's what the exhibition is about. You will see the industriousness and the tenacity of the Ghanaian brought to bear in the quality of the products and of course the food. This exhibition is testament to the fact that Ghanaian products are of an excellent quality, offer value for money, and can compete globally. Invited guests on an investment front the audience can expect the best of services. 
For those of you who are interested in translating your intentions into action, the Ghana Investment Promotion Center will roll out the red carpet for you when you arrive in Accra. Government policies on investment are clear. Investments are allowed in all sectors of the economy. Partnerships are strongly encouraged. I urge the French investor community to engage with the Ghanaian business community present for this mission and the Ghanaian community already living here in France to pursue further opportunities for partnerships. The increased focus of the current government on producing and consuming goods and services in country means a greater quantum of resources will be committed to ensuring that all investors continually strive to offer quality goods. For those gathered here who export a lot of goods to Ghana, I take this opportunity to invite you to personally come and produce in Ghana. The GIPC, again, will be there to support you every step of the way. Distinguished guests, when you think about Ghana, we want you to think of the numerous opportunities the country presents. Opportunities in infrastructure, real estate, agriculture, agro-processing, you name it. When you think about Ghana, we want you to think of a warm and friendly people who are ready to do business with you. When you think about Ghana, we want you to think of a strong legal and regulatory framework to support your investments. And finally, when you think about Ghana, we want you to think of a country with an abundance of talents who make your dream business reality. To the Ghanaian investing community based in France, Ghana, home, is ready for you. Whatever your investment needs, we have services to support you. Your Excellencies, distinguished guests, Mesdames et Messieurs, it's my earnest hope that the exhibition will be the beginning of a long and fruitful engagement between the GIPC and the investing community in France. I want to extend my personal thanks again to you and as we roll our promotional video, let's thank Ghana and make it happen. Happy Independence Day. Thank you very much.